Food is not only calories, it's information. It's a powerful signal to our genes. That's the central theme of my research. We cannot change the sequence of our genes, but we can change their activity or expression by choosing what to eat and how much. Think of your genes as a television that you receive as a present from your parents. You cannot choose which type or brand you get, but you can choose which channels you watch. The remote control in your hands is called epigenetics. Epigenetic modifications are molecular tags on our genes that can turn them on or off. Just like a dimmer switch can modulate lights up and down in a room. In contrast, to genes, these switches change in response to lifestyle signals such as diet, exercise or stress, thus changing the expression, not the sequence, of genes that make us healthy or sick. That's the main goal of our project Obedia Mark, which has received funding from the European Union's Horizon 2020 programme. This prestigious award has turned on new light in my research career. I have initiated collaborations with the University of Vienna and Stanford University to identify epigenetic biomarkers of type 2 diabetes and obesity. The results of this project may turn on a new channel in the field of personalized medicine and enable precise prediction and effective prevention of obesity and type 2 diabetes.